Yeah, thank you. Great. Um, actually, I'm not from England, so sorry for my English. If there are some mistakes, please. Yeah. Obviously, we'll notice I'm from Germany, so if there's my accent is a little bit weird. So, uh, what are we having? We're having here an, a platform which is uh, based on uh, VR content. So, what we're having is what always has driven the industry. The industry got always driven by adult content. So, the internet got broader because people wanted to see more internet stuff, more porn, more everything, online shopping, DVDs, the first uh, internet site which took millions was a site in America which down, where we could download porn, actually, in a way, or if I have to say here, sorry, adult content. Uh, I get there in here. So there is a, the money that you get spent on porn is quite amazing if you compare it to the Hollywood outcome. There are 600 movies which takes 10 billion dollars every year and in the entertainment in the adult entertainment there are 13,000 13, films and the exceeding a profit of 15 billion dollars so there is a, a lot of money in there if you compare it with um, NFL NBA major baseball league they're taking less money than the adult uh, industry in the US still so there is some money out there Yeah, you can see our idea is that there is obviously the digital revolution is imminent. So, we are the first mover in this industry. We're having the first VR platform, the first VR content, which is there, which is out there by us. But what exactly is VR content? Nobody knows it. Everybody heard a little about it, but nobody got into it that much. So. VR content is kind of also very driven by Mark Zuckerberg. He said, till the end of 2020, a third of the US people will have VR glasses and use it the world. And he says, it will not change the world, it will, it will make it better. You can do in, in, in adult content, you can put in everything. everything. Everything you desire can be created in this world and can be shown 24 hours a day. There you get some, there are also some numbers which are incredible. You can see like a Pornhub, uh, which is a site nobody knows about for sure, but some people heard about it from other people or knows a friend who knows a friend. 81 million people are there daily on this site. Yeah, it's just on one side. So there is kind of a market for stuff like this. There's some more data, which you also can see. I can send everybody to deck now. I don't want to bore you with all the numbers coming out now. Uh, but uh, the uh, one is also incredible. I think um, the Chinese people, they spend nine hours a day on their phone and social media and in the network in the world. So that's kind of very used to it. <laughs> now I'm coming up with some very, very interesting numbers. There you can see how the uh, AR and VR market will grow over the next years. We are here very little now at, at seven 0.2 billion in 2018 and in 2020 they expect already 28 billion every year there's a lot of money spent on the in the market investors i don't know if you kind of know about leap glasses which is a us company that they just rate, raised this year 2 billion just for the new glasses for vr the average you can see here how many people are watching. It's, in the moment, it's a lot of guys watching VR, actually having VR glasses and use VR glasses. There's a statistic about everything that is out there. What you can see for, for us, there's an important market. Obviously, there's people using this in a way, kind of males, females. It's at the moment, it's um, most of the males between 18 and 34 are using VR glasses and are into this technology. So. Let me tell you a bit about our company, which is the most important part, I think. It's not that we're coming out uh, at the moment and saying, yes, we wanted to have an ICO. The company is already on the market for three years. We are creating VR stuff for a long time. Uh, we actually started with 3D figurines, uh, as everybody got there and had these 3D figurines around in the world, and then we created the avatars. So we said, we want to go digital. So we're working on the project for three years and already have content in Berlin. Uh, we have a company with 30 people coming out there. So we started there 
you generated a 3D scan database. We already have uh, about 700 uh, models under license and uh, have uh, started in online shops in the US selling uh, the data for the avatars and also for the avatars by themselves and the figurines, obviously. So this is what's going on. So this is where we are now, 2017. We already have a beta coming out from the VR, which you also can see at our booth and try it if you want. Our project is the first interactive VR platform worldwide. There's nothing like this. There's nothing you can try, nothing you can compare with it. It's interactive. There's something you can do, everything on the platform. You can go there, you can go into this world. We can work as an affiliator. You can try this, you can sell advertising. You can do all the stuff that you can do in the real world. You can also do in the VR world. So actually there is no limit to the things that you can put in this VR world. Content is possible. People can create their own content. You can go there. If you have a fetish, you can do whatever you like. 24 hours, you can repeat it as much as you want. Everything is possible. And our idea is that obviously we created content, but the most important thing is that normal people, customer, will can create their own stuff. So it's like I and my girlfriend, we can make sex, we film it in the VR world, we put it out there, and we get paid. And this is the, where the blockchain kicks in, because we're paying the people by smart contracts. So if I have something, people watch it, I get immediately the money and I immediately get the share, as also the models get their share immediately, and no, no, nobody is in between uh, you and the, the payment. So in a, in a way, if, if you see it, you should really come and try it, because if you speak about it, it's a little bit boring. If you try it, you will see how it really is. There you can also get some, some images from the world which we already created. This is how it looks like. And I, and I tell you honestly, this is not as good as you have the glasses on. It's just pictures taken from the world. It looks more realistic once you have the glasses. Last week, we had somebody coming into our office trying it. He took off the glasses and he said, oh, it feels like a, bit, a little bit I cheated on my girlfriend. So it's kind of, it's kind of nice and weird. So it's absolutely brilliant. This is how, actually how we uh, have the menu. You pick one of the girls, you put it there, and then you can do something. You can lap dance. You can watch them. There's also an affiliate place where you can have um, all the clothes, the dildos, whatever you like, whatever is there, you can have it. See there, this is how it goes. More information about it. Stuff, pictures taken. And this is also the difference between other companies. We already have the product. There is something really out. You can come and visit us anytime in Berlin. There are over 30 people working in this project. There's really something going on and not like, hey, we have a project and you can see it in two years and we might have there something. But in between, it's nice to be on an island. We're really working on stuff. So this is actually the first scenario we have is a 50 years diner where people can interact and speak to other people and see the girls running around or guys, whatever you prefer. This is a picture of an avatar from the back. This is not a real person, just if you think it. It's a scan that we took from the person which was alive. And also the scan system is a part of our co company because we are building the scanner by ourselves. So this is also Texas Patty is one of our models. You can see there is a sample. There you can see also the difference between if you have some idea about VR, there's also a Facebook version of the world, which is Facebook Spaces. There you can create your own avatar, which looks a little bit like it. This is the left is Mark Zuckerberg. This is Rachel. And there you can see the VRX City quality, uh, which we are having, which is a digital person in our world. So this is our partners. So what is also important for you if you want to invest, it's also the idea, oh, what has happened to the coin? Because everybody is saying, yeah, we're coming out with a product and then you can't pay for it for another two years. So everybody is saying, yeah, yeah, I'm coming three, three days after the ICO, I will spend everything immediately, which doesn't make obviously most of the time any sense. We already start before the ICO happened and before the ICO ends with these partners. Um, I can tell you later about it, uh, but it's Wicked Films, it's Jessica Drake, as Akira, I Want Empire. I Want Empire is also a place where the 8,000 chem girls are and they're accepting from the first day our currency. 
which means uh, if you, if you notice that uh, the girl that fifteen dollars an hour, you can see the turnover and the turnaround of the coin immediately from day one. So there will be a usage immediately and not like wasting in a platform. So we're working with plenty of people. There's also, uh, actually, I'm, I'm a little bit disappointed because there's a big seven.com missing, which is also a company which has uh, 10,000 chem girls, and they are actually based in Europe, and they also will make advertising from, for, the, for us uh, to their customers beginning next week. There you can see, yeah, this is, we are really the first one who's doing this, uh, in the world, there's nothing else that you can see. There's nothing around. There's just some other people trying to get an avatar, but you can see how we can use it. You can use it as a, to sell merchandise, as an affiliator. There's new ways of uh, kind of revenue streams. You can have advertising in these uh, VR platforms. There's a tracking system. So if you have there like in the bar that you've seen before, if you have there Diet Coke in the corner and people look at the Diet Coke or play with it, you already can track how long this got be taken in the hands or looked at and people get paid immediately. The target group, it's, um, we have there like, I think at the moment they get, uh, every month get 800,000 VR glasses get sold. So you can see the growth and there is in April comes out the um, VR glasses, um, Oculus Go, which costs $200. So this is kind of also, yeah, nice and different. So our vision. Our vision is obviously to uh, create a platform which everybody can use, put their this own own content, and it's a self-growing platform where people get paid through the blockchain system and get paid for everything. This is real ex uh, real estate version in this VR form that you have there clubs, you can meet people, you have a Tinder in VR version, you have social contacts with other people, even if you say this is kind of created for um, living on the sofa. All right. <coughs> this is actually about the, the cryptocurrency. I think everybody who's here knows about it a little bit. What are we doing there? This is a payment. It's action. It's, it's the casting. We have selected over 700 girls already, which are under contract with us and get scanned. And they all were coming uploaded now into the world and you can use them wherever you want and ever you do. So why cryptocurrency? There's also still, nowadays it's kind of also still a little bit critical for some people to pay with Visa card or cash or get into this world because it's a little bit, everybody is using it, everybody is into adult content, but everybody has a little bit of problem of kind of admit to it a little bit. So you can use it anonymized. There's no cost of kind of um, payments. It's direct immediately. It's kind of very costless actually in a way the people can kind of become partner of the of the of the um, of the world they can do their own stuff it's really kind of very good for people who want to just participate in this world new horizon redbox community is already very strong oh, you dropped there something um, avoid excessive fees it's fair, transparent, so the people who participate or build something in the world can immediately see how much money they make. It's very, very transparent, actually, what we built there. So what is our plan at the moment for you? The most important questions, but by now it was maybe a little bit just about the product. So we're having an ICO upcoming, I can send you an email later, an ICO upcoming on the 22nd of uh, March, and then we're there in the, the phase uh, till the 15th of April. The main sale starts then from the 16th of April. Our total supply is uh, 200 million, and the crowd sale amount is 130 million, uh, which sounds a lot, but uh, if you see that we are the first one and the only one, and we're already coming up with strong partners, uh, this is kind of possible at the moment. Our pre-sale, you get there a discount of 35%, and we are accepting US dollar, Euro, and Ethereum. This is also hard kept. There's more information. I can also send this a deck to you if you want, if you have some questions about it, because there's more information in, in behind this. But here you can see it's the marketing, uh, how it got splitted operations. And I mean operations is with us. It's of, we have like 30 people working there in this company, business development. And there you see how it's going to get split in the allocations. 
So why red bucks? This is still also the question. If you're now investing into a cryptocurrency, you have also the idea, oh, I'm doing this, I'm going working with a company who is, uh, has the, the operation in England and the rest in Switzerland, in Puerto Rico, or you name it, Singapore. For us, it was important to be very transparent and very clear. So we worked together with the BaFin in Germany and we really confirmed with the law to make sure that nothing happened to the money which got invested there and also nothing, no problems to the product. So this is what's very important for us. Yeah, then it's obviously like we have 7,000 cam girls there with I Want Empire plus the other one. So it's 17,000. We're also working with a lot of retailers already together. So, so mortal and uh, brick and mortar outlets, they are accepting our currency, which is really strong. So this is what I said before, it gives you a shorter information was about it. You can see that it's red bucks. The pre-sale starts 22nd of March and goes to the 16th of uh, April. And there you can get a great discount, a great bargain for, for your money. So uh, to come also to our testimony, this is Jessica Drake. She really took the glasses and she was amazed. She uh, tried it last year at the AVN and she was absolutely up for it and really is uh, into it. If you don't know Jessica Drake, you, you might uh, Google for her. You find uh, some pictures. This is uh, Steve Orenstein is one of our strongest partners in the US. It's the second largest uh, movie makers for adult content um, in the world. And they're working with us together on this project. And it's really a huge advisor and a very strong partner that we have there already. So yeah, that was it actually from my side. Um, it was a little bit in a hurry and sorry for that because it's not my native language. So I'm always getting there a little bit uh, stressed out of speaking in English. So I'm sorry for that. But if you have further questions, plus come to our booths, ask me whatever you like. I'm up to everything and I will answer everything as possible as I can. Yeah, thanks for your attention. And uh, yeah, that's, that's me, lovely picture. You see Photoshop is doing a good job. That's it. If you have any questions, just let me know. And yeah, thanks for your attention and that you're really here and interested in this new stuff. It's absolutely great. Thanks. Thanks, everyone.